Hello again, brothers and sisters in Christ. Uh, let's see, it's still Wednesday, April 7th, and now it's 11 o'clock a.m. Okay, I have a twofer here. One, I put up a video on BitChute, and I will, it's about the nasal swab test. Okay, a Minister Michael put up a video stating he's got a, a document from an, uh, he, he can't tell the source, but the guy went to get a test and he grabbed it and ran. He took it to a, a I guess he had a microscope. I think he said, or put it under a microscope. And sure enough, there's something on the end of it, he says. He says it's giving the, the vaccine, the virus, but that's odd because there really isn't one. So, you know, I questioned it, but I put it up and invited anyone that wanted to to do more research on it, put it in the comments, so I could upload it because I don't have time or the, my brain just wants to, if I go to site after site after site and I can't find what I'm looking for, I get frustrated. So anyway, so I'm not a very good researcher as some of you will testify to gladly. Anyway, I do the best I can. So I will leave a link in the description box for my video on BitChute. Or you can just go there and type in Jeannie Loves Jesus and you'll get to my channel. All one word, okay? Don't put spaces between the three words. It's Jeannie Loves Jesus, like all one word, but capitalize the words. Okay, now, on to this story. I got a more information about the ship that's under attack from Grafted In Team Jesus sent me this. They sent the one from our Fugal. And now she has more information. And it's called, her title is Breaking. Sorry, when I do that, it is not 666. Okay. Don't say that I do that sign. I don't. It's just habit because I've done it all my life. Breaking, Israel claims responsibility for attacking Iranian Revolutionary Guard ship in the Red Sea. And, let's see, it's from Grafted in Team Jesus, and it says, um, well, that's the link. Where did I hear it say, um, must have been in her email, where she said, basically, she said, okay, after I sent that to you, we dug a bit more detail on it. She means the first email this morning. Basically, the attack happened yesterday. But nobody claimed responsibility. Then late last night, our time, which is upper state New York is Eastern time, Israel officially claimed responsibility. And God woke me up at 4 a.m. and told me to get up and check things. That's when I saw Marfugel. And I knew this is a big deal. I just sent out my short recording from early this morning that I uploaded. And that's what I'm sharing with you now. Okay? All right. So now I can delete that and go. Oh, I can delete that. Okay. Um, so anyway... I think I told you all that I needed to tell you. But Israel claims responsibility. Israel attacks Iranian command ship in Red Sea. Report. U.S. officials 
details New York Times that Israel said mine attack, it was a mine attack, was retaliation for earlier Iranian strikes on Israeli vessels. So they started it. All right, that's what I didn't, that's what I wanted to tell you. I couldn't figure out where did I see that? It was before you click play, that's what you see. Okay, so I will click on, I was trying to see if there was a different link, but no, that's the link I want. So um, I'll end this here. I'll say bye for now and I'll talk to y'all later.